I am fascinated with the vast diversity of the human imagination and I'm inspired by the curiosities of the world. I create art to both synthesize my experiences while also testing the limits of my own creativity. When I paint, I become infatuated with my subject, painting it over and over again, slightly different each time. Lately, my inspiration stemmed from two recent loves, scuba diving and beekeeping. Scuba diving and beekeeping incite a similar state of mind, one that is meditative, though still buzzing, with an undercurrent of danger. Vibrant colors and strange creatures intertwine in my paintings, creating odd yet beautiful and believable worlds. Worlds that imitate the juxtaposition of the relaxed yet tense environment I feel when participating in both beekeeping and scuba diving. The vibrant colors playfully invite the viewer into the world where they can explore the limits of their own imagination. Here's an introduction of some of my paintings. My name is Melissa Farley. I am both, a, both an artist and an art educator. So an example of exploring the same subject multiple times can be seen in these paintings of the bees. In some of them, I focus just on the bee itself. Um, but then I slowly started putting the bee in different situations. I really like thinking of the bee and using it as a motif as almost like a canary in a coal mine type of deal, where um, some of the issues we're seeing with bees are a um, signal for larger problems within our environment. So an example of that is this acrylic painting of the bees and the skull together. I also really like to then um, kind of combine my interests. So these two paintings are um, an example of how I combined my love of scuba diving and beekeeping. So in this one, I almost created like this otherworldly type situation where the bees are underwater, but they're very clearly not struggling. Um, it's almost like they're pollinating the coral. Um, which goes along with this one, where I had, instead of bees, I had a creature um, swimming around amongst the coral. For this painting right here, um, I painted this when I was struggling with a creative block. And so what I wanted to do was do a painting where I can um, use things I knew. I painted a lot of bees by this point. However, I also just kind of wanted to throw all of my ideas into one painting. So it's a little bit disjointed, a little bit chaotic, but um, still ties together some of my themes. Um, before I was really excited about bees and scuba diving, I went through a stage where I painted a bunch of anatomically correct portraits, um, but in very interesting colors that showed off the musculature or even the layering of the musculature. I even did a few where I painted on plexiglass so that they would reflect and create a really interesting um, visual that way. And I feel like this all kind of ties in together. I have interest in nature and in skulls and in anatomy and in bright colors. And so it creates this body of work that's United in some characteristics, but also very, very different. I think that really shows a piece of my personality as an artist, where I have some themes where you could that you could see throughout, but some, um, but it's not all the same. It's not all quite cohesive, and that reflects my view as an artist. Thank you so much.